our point of entry The alarm doesn't ease you in gently Don't ask questions or interact with me Until I've had at least my morning coffee It may be bright but my head is cloudy It's far too early for Lewis Capaldi Why is the radio always mocking me? I've even had my morning coffee Oh cool, cool world These beans they bind I need these filters For the daily climb Only just up and already in morning Meant to feel great but just feel appalling You'll get no well-wishing or clarity Until I've had at least my morning coffee The groggy mind full of nighttime fluff Knee-jerk reactions flinging off the cuff Yeah, bloody blah, it's my destiny To sort this out but first morning coffee Oh, cool, cool fate In myself I find Sorting, it's a total mess But with this drum brew I'm pretty impressed I've started glowing, I'm the fuzziest bee Now that I've harbined in my morning coffee Just don't do research or look anything up You won't be pleased with how it gets to your cup It's a dire and troubled history Perilous journey of the morning coffee Damages untold Treacherous escapades All the brain cells dull Oh, cool, cool world These beans they bind I need these filters For the daily grind Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Morning coffee. That was Morning Coffee by Cosmic Boss. Yes it was. Welcome to Cosmic Boss Music Podcast. Is that what it's called? That's what it, we're called. Yeah. Cosmic Boss Music Podcast, yeah. Best th- of season four, baby. Boss four. Boss four. Best of season four. Yeah. Um, um my my co host this evening is uh, the same as every time we do this podcast yeah it is you who it's are you it, it's me i'm nick and that's my nick. and my co-host is you that and that and that's me that's andy yeah clever so, yeah but our surname is jackson we both have the same surname we're brothers do we say that a lot i don't know okay I, well I, for just, any new listeners that didn't know that uh, just a, a quick shout out to uh, new music saturday guys uh, intergalactic shout out Inter- they uh, they call us the jackson brothers occasionally that's quite cool nice. yeah yeah, we are. That's it's also factually accurate. It is. It's so it's factually. Accurate. So it's nice. It's nice that people are factually accurate. We'll take it. Yeah, I'm happy with it. But yeah, man. So um, how you doing? I'm doing good. Yeah. Yeah. How are you doing? I'm beautiful, thank you. It's uh, in the festive times. Getting ready for festive times. Yeah. yeah. End of 22. It's been a good year. It's been a great year for yeah. us. Has it? Has it been the best year ever? It's possibly been the best year ever really yeah every year should be the best year ever every so. year should get better things should only get better someone like that wrote might song be a song someone definitely wrote a song about that things should only get better year on year you greg kinnear greg was it greg kinnear did he write it i wish he did but Spoiler i don't think that. greg kinnear wrote a song <laughs> he didn't really <laughs> just jolting with you <laughs> anyway, welcome to yeah. the best of season four. That's it. 2022. We made a few records this year, didn't we? It's good. Yeah, man. It's been a great year. We've done uh, we've done quite a bit. We have. Um, we're we're going to like fold back. I mean, if you listen to best of season one, the season two, or best of season three, we're kind of going to follow the same pattern. Well, kind of. I mean, I think in those ones, at least in best of one and best of two, we had the monkeys. So, so the monkeys are not present. There's no monkeys There's anymore. No Jethro. No. 
Well, um, we could get Jethro in no, if you want. Well, we'll, mean, we'll, we'll see if he's about later. get him on the phone. Yeah, we'll see if he's about later. And we could yeah. add in a phone effect. Oh, clever. Yeah, like we used to. We yeah, haven't done that. You're giving away your anymore. tricks. It's, it's um, podcasting 101. This, that's a good thing about this year. This year, we've been, we've been naked to you, to you, the listener. Yeah. We've taken off all of our musical robes and been bare and shown you the process. Who, yeah, of and, making music and how we do it right? yeah yeah that's very true what's and all so yeah so and so at the beginning of this year way back in sort of january february time yeah in january we put out Bo- uh, boss live one didn't we it did which was a few tracks we did with joe joe yeah. philogene intergalactic shout out intergalactic joe shout out. what's bigger than intergalactic nothing right so it's the biggest, the biggest. that is the highest one you can have cool yeah just checking maybe outer galactic we feel like this is this is a discussion of we've had this discussion of before three. okay this is if this you want to if you want to hear the rest of this conversation go back to best of season three yes yeah, so in best of season three we gave uh, an outer galactic shout out to joe philogene cool. um, we obviously follow that through this year with yeah. the same Always. a double outer galactic shout out to joe so that's made it bigger and he he features across the year so he will but this is will him playing right now this is joe yeah if we ever listen should we just you shut up for a sec shut up it's nice isn't it that's joe playing the angoni and in fact this very song underneath our our gibberings is uh chomping on lumiere yeah. which was um opening track yes, to the opening track to Petit Champignon de Lumière. Which was uh, Improv Squared, actually. Yeah, the uh, full title was... Because we squared. have ridiculously long titles for yeah. our albums for some yeah. reason. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, yeah, let's call this album the, Improv Squared, uh, Petit Champignon de Lumière. That's what people do, though, right? That's, long titles are cool now. Yeah. Like, we're, you know, we've been, we've been trying to keep it cool. Yeah, we're, we're being long hip. titles. Yeah. And hip replacement. So, uh, and that's, so the, you know, this song is actually a kind of named after the album. Yeah. Right? It is. Um, uh, this has actually got like us playing eggs yep. egg shakers and it's clapping me. that's me and you clapping it's us clapping and in the in the full version uh, spoiler alert if you want to go back <laughs> and listen to it um, it actually has us all singing doesn't it it's yeah. myself you and my uh, wife our wife and your wife yeah and, uh, and Theo 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 was, Theo, Theo was making noise right he wasn't I like think he was kind of staring at all of us going what the hell are you doing there's definitely Theo noise in there though if you, you can hear it So, uh, but he wasn't talking or anything yeah. at that point no. That's well old now. It so is well old. Beginning of the year. But morning coffee. Let's go back to that song. You want to talk about morning coffee? Just quickly. Oh yeah. I love morning coffee. Uh, so that that was off Virtual Normality. So the, one of the more Spoiler recent alert. things we uh, <laughs> released. Spoiler alert. Yeah. So oh, that's you from can't the end say of the it year. after. Sorry. Spoiler alert. That was one of the more recent songs we li- released. Yeah. If you're listening to this, like in the future, like when we've recorded it or near then. If you listen to it in the past, like that's amazing. How are you doing yeah, that? But if you're listening to it in 50 years, like, this was, this is well old. You should be doing something else with your yeah. time. Yeah, what's happened to music? Oh, you can't tell us, obviously, we're in the past, and this is a recording. <laughs> <laughs> um, but anyway, yeah, yeah. email cosmicboss <laughs> at gmail.com. That's it. If that's emails, it. Do, do they still exist in yeah, the future? Yeah, because emails have been around forever. And they haven't been around forever. Going. No, not forever. They've been around since, like, the 80s. Oh, you, yeah, but that's ages. That's, that's a, it's a, pretty it's 80s. It's a good length right. of time yeah. to be around, like, be an important part of the game you know so they're, they're emails are around yeah emails yeah, they are, are sticking around excellent so yeah email us from the future tell us what's going on and we'll be like well you've only just listened to season four best of we made that years ago we've done all this other stuff since then we've, we've got waffled classic yeah. okay so should, should, what, should we play another song let's play another song okay. we were talking about chomping on lumiere so yeah, the, the first record that we put out this year was actually boss live one but then after that we put out improv squared petty chomping on to lumiere yeah and uh, our first single from that record was a song where we used lyrics written by my good friend Dana Howcroft. Dana, shout out Dana. Mm, intergalactic, In, intergalactic, outer galactic, uh, shout out to Dana. Outer, inter outer galactic. Dana rules. Yeah, Dana's a ledge, mate. Absolute ledge. Yeah, thank you, Dana. First of all, that's it for like giving us some, some words to play with, or your, your words, in fact. We haven't even done yep. anything to it. We just put some music to them. We just sang them over some music. Um, so so we, let's hear one of them. Yeah? Let's hear this it. Is, uh, this is Faded Memories. Taken from the same album, Improv Squared, squared, Petit Petit Champignon de Lumière, French.
picture was clear I'm set for adventure No need to fear We're total control of The road ahead The future was never A dream to dread Wasting time on Hot summer's day No wasted laughter My mind portrayed A life of freedom With hope and meaning A picture gave me Something to believe in Through my hand Back then I could Never quite understand How life can be brutal How life can be cruel I guess I forgot The golden rule Never look back And regret what is done Life can be beautiful If you're willing to run If you're willing to Famous words of Guy Garvey from when we went to the elbow play. Beautiful! That is exactly what he said and how he said it. In that tone, wasn't it? Yeah. I've been and he even done the little hand movement that you've done, couldn't which see, is pointless yeah. for the podcast, but yeah. um, but it was beautiful. I did enjoy it. Beautiful! Yeah, that's got some classic um, one-string solo. Yep. And yeah, you might be the best one-string solo guitar player in the world, I reckon. Thanks. Even better than The Edge. Yeah. Oh, mate. Oh. Is he good? Oh, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> slagging off you two there. Sorry, you two. Um, they're, they're brilliant. Yeah, they're doing their thing. Yeah, man. you know, like, they've, they've made been a lot doing of their money thing for, for years as well. Yeah. Like, With or without you, mm. no, it's they nice. can't live. Apparently, yeah. yeah. A, a quick funny aside about you two. Like uh, we had an amusing moment at work once where we had the '80s radio on, and the uh, the U2 song "Still Haven't Found What I'm Looking For" came on, and we were listening to it. Blue now, Bono. Like, yeah. t- look, come back and tell us when you found it, all right? You <laughs> yeah, moaning yeah. about not finding it. Have but then, hold on. The next song played on the radio was Banana Rama's "She's Got It." You're like, there you go, Bono. She's got <laughs> it. She's got it. Nice. Mm-hmm. Okay. Has he written a song about finding it? Um, has he found it? Like, yeah. a, like a sequel. Sequel songs. Do they exist? They should do. That is, that's we, a cool we idea. We should pioneer it. I mean, spoiler alert. But um, <laughs> <laughs> I can't remember the name of the band. Some country artist. That, Mum, our mum would correct us on. Yeah, the Sarah of Jackson. Yeah, she um, loves country. She yeah, sh- shout them. out to mum. They're brothers as well. Something sh- brothers. Sh- sh- the, shout um, out, mum. Cowboy brothers. The cowboy brothers. <laughs> Is that what they're called? The Wilbury brothers. The no, there's not the travelling Wilburys. Um, okay, the anyway, brothers, the two something brothers. something twins, Texas twins, <laughs> Texas twins. Um, released a song called "He's an Old Hippie." Have you heard that song? Uh, probably. He's an old hippie. Something like that. It's all about being yeah. a hippie yeah. from the 60s, needing to grow up in the 70s or 80s or something like that. Right. And then a couple of years, 20 years later, they did a sequel to that. He's uh, still an old hippie. Cool. And then they did another one like 20 more years later. What called? He's, he's I'm still an I'm still. Guess what? I'm guess still, what? still, 20 still years an old hippie. Still an even older hippie. I like an even older hippie. I said because if he was older the first time, he's going to be well old oh by yeah. the second, and then like super old by the third. So. so sequel songs, they are a thing. I think um, they're quite a cool idea. We should do it. We should do it. Sequel we probably songs. have we done it already? Probably. Yeah. 
Um, Brilliant. <laughs> Brilliant. Good, good we talk. don't even good know. We don't even know. Uh, well, maybe we should we'll delete spin that, that off into delete a delete it. No, no. Delete the year. Done. Delete the year. Rubbish. Get that sequel song idea. Awful. See. Or we could make an entire new podcast about it. I like it. We Sick. should try that. Yeah. Yeah. If we've got time. Songs that are sequels sequel to the podcast songs. series. I tell you what, we'll release a B-side record called Sequel Songs. Oh, I like and it. And we'll write like a little sequel. Yeah, like besides. B- <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah, besides. On board. Look at that, man. We've named albums and stuff before we've even thought about it. Yeah, perfect. Cool, cool. man. Um, Faded Memories is a lovely tune. By the way, I enjoy that. I enjoy that one. I remember like... Um, you playing that, and and in fact, again, if you've listened to the podcast back then, the Champignon one, I'm pretty sure I said this exact same thing. Was like, spoiler I alert. wasn't digging it. Spoiler alert! <laughs> no, I wasn't digging it because you picked a mental set of drums. <laughs> and it's like, so yeah, I turned up with a, a set of chords, a set and, of uh, chords, and the right. lyrics were, that were already written by Dana, and um, I played them to you, and you were like, okay, cool. So let's mm. pick a drum beat yeah. to go with it for us to record our improv squared version. Yeah. And I chose an absolutely mental yeah, drum beat. Yeah, yeah, well, that drum beat that you heard, yeah. that drum beat, it, I mean, like, it's played with a little bit, but yeah, that drum beat. And I remember at the time thinking, like, man, this song is mental. And then it came together, like, absolutely beautifully. It's great. It's our first single of the year. Yeah, really? Yeah, it's that and uh, another one. I don't one. even remember. Astral Underwear? Was it Ensemble Story? Something like that. I'll have a look. Well done. Da, da, da. Looking on our phones, going on the spot, rubbish podcasting, bad podcasting, Spotify. What was I doing? Oh, I yeah, don't know, <laughs> mate. I don't <laughs> even know. Our first singles were yeah. Faded Memory on Ensemble Storm. Right. right, you knew that, so why did you Google it? I, 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 well, I said it might have been that or Astral, Astral Underwear. Astral Underwear was the next one. Is that the next song? No, it's not. No, <laughs> man. There's some there somewhere there. <laughs> it's coming up. Oh, what a spoiler alert. <laughs> spoiler alert. Sorry, guys. Okay. Didn't spoiler alert it. Yeah. Right. Okay, cool. Well, so three, yeah, Faded Memories, first yeah. single of the year. What was the second single of the year? Um, it was Astral Underwear. Oh, we just had that conversation. Yeah. What was the third single of the year? It, well, well, actually, all of these were double A sides because we were like, let's put them out as double They're A the sides. Besides, mate. They're They're the besides. A's, A's and the B sides. So, yeah, the fade, Faded Memories besides Ensemble Story, Astral Underwear, Spoiler alert, you'll hear that later. <laughs> it was besides Forever Bruised, yeah. which was the other Dana song. Yeah. Um, spoiler alert, we haven't actually put that in the best of. It is an awesome song, but it's it's quite a, a downbeat song. It's, an, it's, a, it's a very heavy-hearted song, I think, man. It's, we it's, it's highly lovely. advise you go and listen to it. Yeah. Go and check out Beautiful Impulse Squid. Um, go and check out Forever Bruised. Is Shout out to Dana again yeah. for the lyrics, right? It's a very awesome. deep, yeah. deep song. Yeah, man, it's gorgeous. But yeah, and then after that, we put out an, another double A side. Oh, I think yeah. that's actually what we've got lined up next. Yeah, that's what I was hoping for. That's why I kept asking. And they were Sir Francis Cross, the CC, and Vaccine. Okay. Do you, you want to play one of those? I reckon play them both. Play them both. Go. Okay, go for it. Ils vous donneront de l'ail pour le goût, pour le goût. À 
assis trop longtemps sur la bûche. Sitting too long on the lawn. À deux pas. À deux pas. Votre princesse se transforme en grenouille. Lumière rayonnante de petits champignons. Déflexion de tension Prix hors du marché Réflexion de connexion Déflexion de tension Par des injections constantes Mate, shut up, we're playing both of them.
colds and flu or all types of vaccine if the virus is you oh could it be true just like the flu we are the virus the variants too the world is a healing when we stare at the ceiling imagine it Scene. Unfortunately, that song, just by being on the, the best of, probably gets us one of those little COVID warnings. Yeah, that lots of stuff comes up like that. It's like, this mentions COVID-19. Yeah, yeah. Is COVID-19 still a thing? Oh, it's so old school now. Yeah, so right. over it. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Are yeah, you not? Yeah, I, mean, I wasn't even under it. You were next to it. Just I cruising was, alongside yeah, it, going it was, parallel it was, to COVID, Ben. <laughs> It was, it was there. It was, it was there, there doing its thing. Yeah. But I was cool. Making people sick. Yeah. Classic. That's what viruses do, man. Well, it's pretty pretty important one, COVID-19, wasn't it? Mm. Did a bit of a number on the whole world. It was like the whole world was sick for a while. Yeah, the whole world went crazy. Yeah. Uh, memories. <sighs> and that yeah, was our song about it. That was our song about it, yeah. Imagine if humans are the virus and they get... Uh, and with Earth gets a vaccine for us. Yeah. We'd probably be untested, just like... The current <gasps> we're going to conspiracy theories we're, okay we'll stop that's yeah. not that's not what yeah. this is about it's a music podcast if you want to hear conspiracy podcasts um, check them out instead because <laughs> that's not what we're about that's great advice there yeah. like it's again you can't you can't argue that advice and then um, we, sh- we should go back to actually to talk about Sir Francis Cross the Sea oh yeah that's a good one I yeah. like that one Thanks. I like that one too. That Thanks. was one of the. What are we thanking each other? <laughs> because we're great. And, and okay. yeah, spoiler alert. Okay. <laughs> we made all this music ourselves. So oh, we're yeah. going to pat this ourselves on the back. This year. Yeah. Like, all of these songs, there's a few, all made this year. Yeah. And there's a spoiler alert. There's some special stuff towards the end, which we didn't even make. Oh, like, yeah. Spoiler alert. Like, like, a real spoiler, spoiler alert. Like, don't say anything. Oh, yeah. Oh, I used it right. <laughs> nice. Um, yeah, so France then. So. So it's probably one of our most interesting videos we've ever made. Yeah. We uh, green screened it and uh, I got my friend from work who is a sign language interpreter to teach me all of the French, all of the sign language versions yeah. of it. And then we filmed it in front of a green screen. It was fantabulous. Yeah. It was great because I remember thinking, oh, at the time I was like, oh, you're good. You're, you might have to do it bit by bit, but you nailed it in one go. I did spend two a chunk of time practicing it. Yeah. yeah, it's great. And that like that totally worked for the video. That's why we chose to never move you from yeah, the, yeah, just stayed in even when spot. there was instrumental. It's like just keep you there. It made me stand there looking like a lemon. Yeah, but you've yeah. done that all by yourself. Or an right? onion. It's French, more French if I look like an onion. And Theo, you can play Find Theo. Find Theo. That was no, a good game. Yeah. Do you remember how many Theos there were? I do, but I'm cool. not revealing it here because we should still encourage people to go play that game. Go and. So go back to Sir France Across the CC on YouTube or yeah. whatever, wherever in you watch podcast, your videos. In this, po- in this and, podcast and in feed. in this podcast feed. And play a game called Fi- How Many Theos? How Many Theos Can You Find Throughout That Video? Yeah. There so is a correct answer and only one correct answer. <laughs> <laughs> we dressed Theo up in little Frenchman outfit, didn't we? He looks as French as a baby's going to look in a stripy <laughs> t-shirt, yeah. <laughs> Did he have a beret? I had Keep, a beret. Keeping hats on Theo is quite difficult. Was. Did you maybe have a little scarf? I don't know. Oh, yeah. We should probably we'll watch the this. video. We, we'll go and watch the video and then we'll we'll come back. And then we also made a video for vaccine. We did make mm. a video for vaccine using more green screen. Yeah, this time green screen face mask. Green screen face masks. Cool mm. idea. And all we put on them was other faces. <laughs> Ourselves. <laughs> no, <was> other faces. <laughs> yeah, we did. We could have like told. We could have done more. We maybe squandered that idea a little bit, but that's fine. You know. No, I think it was, I can't. Yeah, I think the idea was big. The idea was great. I think we did kind of pull it off, but it's also a little bit based on the cry video by Godly and Cream. Spoiler alert! I went to see Ten CC this year. They were amazing. Yeah, amazing. Uh, with neither Godly or Cream present, because well, yeah. 
spoiler alert. <laughs> how many? Okay, how many spoiler alerts have we done so far? <laughs> Several. You, you like you say spoiler alert for almost every sentence you're gonna say. I'm trying to make it a thing. No, I like it. I like yeah. it. I what like it. Think? I'm saying, I'm saying like, hashtag spoiler alert, man. People do that for other things. If they hashtag spoiler alert for Cosmic Boss, it means people will be like, "What are they spoiling?" Always, yeah. I don't know. Uh, we're, I really we're, all we're spoiling is the next 30 seconds. Yeah, but, well, no, spoiler alert might be further than that. <laughs> you never know. That's why you got yeah. to go with it, go with the flow. Anyway, that was back scene. You can argue that. So Francis crossed the CC. Yeah. Um, cool. Yeah. Uh, this was, uh, well, we're still rocking that album at the moment, so we're sitting on songs from um, Petit Champignon, Champignon de Lumiere. Yeah. Uh, some small tiny mushrooms of uh, light yeah tiny mushrooms of light yeah. Yeah. great nice. great album title and plus French educational yeah. we're, we're you know we're, we're, language, try, we're breaking language barriers we're, we're trying to have some fun and try try new things right so that, yeah, that song I think is definitely yeah. a, an idea that we've had for a while but um, something that we've yeah, never actually great. pushed for um, I love it it's one of my favourite songs we've ever made in the world yeah in the world that's great man um, so should we spin on yeah People listen to us well for enough. Yeah, sure, so. sure, mate. I'm going to play Astral Underwear. Underwear. Yeah, play Astral Underwear. This was actually Improv Squared, wasn't it? This is proper Improv Squared. We we did this and then um, <laughs> Nick's looking at me like, still shut talking. up. He's still talking. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we'll talk about it afterwards. Just play the song Astral Underwear. Oh, oh, oh. 
That's good advice. That is um, all totally made up on the spot. Yeah. Right. Well, uh, it was a set of written lyrics. A set of lyrics, but, but we melody, and melody, yeah. uh, and all like I didn't know any of the words, and then I'm singing harmonies all over it. Yeah. Yeah, that was like that was our experiment to basically be like impro- improvise a song, re-improvise it, re-improvise it, and re-improvise it using uh, a different instrument or a vocal or. And we did, we did it for that song and Ensemble Story. So if you check mm. out Ensemble Story as well, which didn't make the best of Didn't make it. Even though it's probably better than Astral Underwear. but It's definitely better than Astral Underwear. So if you want to hear a better song than the one you just heard, go and check out Ensemble so Story. We, something we were talking about pioneering earlier on is the best of a best of. So Ensemble Story, that's not part of the best of season four. It's the best of the best of season four. So it's in its own secret category. It's best, it's Do you remember the, that best of? We invented spoiler alert. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It wasn't spoiler alert. He was. We, he's a character. <laughs> best of the pesto salesman. Yeah, yeah. I remember best of. Of course, back. he's a good guy. I've been I, watching I think, Community recently, so it's like try and get as much callbacks uh, yeah, to like, the old yeah. stuff you're as all possible. Met, you're all meta. I'm all meta right now. Yeah. Yeah. I think uh, once we like come out with a character called Spoiler Alert, then it will be. Then, then we're winning. Spoiler alert. Spoil. Spoiler, 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 Anyway, it's terrible. Anyway, um, yeah, man, Astral Underwear, so yeah, that's, that's, a, that's a good tune. Completely improved. for a bit dancey, all made up on the spot. This was a, this was a fun um, album to make. Yeah. Because this is like basically what we kind of started coming out with once we had done Virtual Normality 1. Mm-hmm which was an EP and a complete test of whether we could do this just the two of us and we done it just the two of us and it looks cool sounds yeah. cool so we um, went on to do a whole album of it well and the exciting thing about it as well is we got Joe involved so Joe was a, a massive part of season three yeah usually we did lots of improv with him he was involved in everything that yeah. we'd done basically and uh, we brought him in to come and record some stuff for Improv Squared we did including the song underneath should we have a quick another listen you listen to it yeah. just be quiet be quieter. Did you be too loud? Sorry. It's nice, isn't it? If you want to hear the actual song, yeah, yeah, you yeah. can just go and listen to it on Spotify. Yeah, that's on the best of the best of. Again. Chomping on you, yeah, it's the best of the best of. Um, but, so, yeah. Surely it should just be best of's best of. Best, best, best of's best of. of. So and that's what he thinks the best songs are. Mm. So so we released the best of season four. And then the best of's of. got his own version, which is the best of the best of. Yeah, I'm best of. Four. I make my own best yeah. of. Best yeah. of's best of. So, and he makes each It contains Champignon Lumiere and Ensemble Story. <laughs> and for some reason, I'm like the Borat. <laughs> yeah. My, and this terrible impression <laughs> of the Borat. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty bad. Yeah, yeah it's awful. Yeah. But I can't drop it now. It's just stuck. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm stuck with my bullet. <laughs> um, but yeah, man, like that's. Uh, let, let's play the next. I song, think we were segue, and that's what well, I was trying we, to do. We were chatting about Joe because we were about to play, and that's clever. Yeah. And you went on a ball rat rant. I, I did. And you ruined it. <laughs> I ruined so it. So I'm deleting it. Oh, and we're going to play better decisions. Bad, 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 bad,
us remixing ourselves isn't yeah, it yeah classic that's us going we, we released it we improvised a song once called Bad Decisions we then recorded a song or played live we did we it live. live we done the live version of Bad Decisions and then went oh we've got another like recording of Joe doing it let's um, improv square it and yeah. lay synths right so we avoided guitars throughout yeah. like uh, play simps and badder decisions came out yeah. which is the same like Scott Andy's same vocal well, de- that's a new demo vocal actually which we just <laughs> yeah I, didn't even, I, didn't even, I phoned it in didn't I it was just like, oh, I just need to phone it but we, we threw it through uh, like a few filters and whatever it sounded and great it sounds cool wow sounds lazy cool. vocal sounds good yeah man sometimes I can make you sound really good you do good work thanks that's why this is the best of it's the best of your work it's the best of my work yeah. not yours so, no, uh, not no, we're, we're a team, man. We're always a team, man. <laughs> we are. And Jackson every, Brothers. And everybody else can come and be a part of the team. That's the point, right? We want to... Absolutely. Get so involved, was, come and make some music. That was our awesome work with Joe Philogene. There's more, spoiler alert, more of that coming up. Oh, mate. Um, <laughs> but then that that marks the end of Improv Squared. Didn't we, we put that at the beginning of April? Was it our April 4th? Yeah, it was an April thing because, um, well, what, what was about to happen yeah. happened, right? So... So at the beginning of the year, we originally set out to make a, an album, and we were releasing the podcast about making the album. Yeah. Um, and then we'd done Champignon, so we'd actually, this came out about April, I think, you're right, because um, we had worked on them for a few months. Mm-hmm. And then what happened, mate? To give the bombshell, spoiler alert, something <laughs> big happened. <laughs> so, yeah, you're right. We were, if you, spoiler alert, you go back to look at our year, we were doing a making of an album series. So... We, and he's explaining exactly I'm re, what I was I'm re-explaining it but with oh, okay. the title so that people can find it oh so yeah, it's like, sorry, yeah it was called the making of an album series at the beginning of the year we were like we're sitting on this record got our improv squared record there we're like we want to make a proper album yeah which we haven't done for years because we've been in the lands of improv mostly yeah um, exactly yeah so we were like okay we're going to write an album and we're going to dissect that whole thing so at the beginning of this year that's what we were doing we um we sat and wrote a song. Yeah, we? we arranged some interviews. We went and did an interview for um, Stuart on Premium Blend. We did. Big shout yeah. out. Outer, Outer Galactic. 
yeah, out yeah, to Galactic. Out to Galactic. Shout out, out, to Stuart, Stuart, going, out of Galactic and everyone. Pebbles. The Pebbles. Awesome. Yeah, the shit was cool. Yeah. And, um, yep. So we arranged that. And I can't remember what else we were doing. We were doing a lot of stuff around that period. Because right. we, were, we had an oh, we did the interview with Mark. Mark Guy. Oh, yeah, on the internet. Schuster. On the internet. Yeah. Yeah. And that was good for us. That was great. Yeah. yeah. That, he also uh, that gave some cool questions. He was like, a, he was it a wasn't a, uh, how do you guys know each other? It was, well, because we're like, we're brothers. Yeah. <laughs> That's a boring it's answer. A brothers question. Yeah. yeah. But, but yeah, so that was interesting. So I'll put a link in to that, um, to that interview spoiler that we did. Alert. Yeah, spoiler alert. There's a link yeah, to that. Yeah, he's going to put a link into it. I'll, I might hopefully, hopefully remember to do yeah, that. Yeah, you will. I'll listen you back will. to this and go, oh, yeah, I've got to do that. Yeah. yeah. Not, if not now someday but yeah he's a dude he's interviewed a lot of people that's um, good check out his blog mm -hmm. it's awesome um, yep so we were doing that and then we were writing our working on our album in a month we made a special podcast where we broke down how to write a song well we wrote a song we wrote right? a song we, yeah. we literally set up a couple of cameras yep. and a microphone I think we were just doing a room microphone yeah and filmed and recorded us writing our song. Yep, so and we got from beginning to end. Ideas. We got from beginning to end didn't we, in about what an hour and a half or something. Mm, yeah, I think Sounds we did longer right. than that. I think we spent uh, quite a long time on it. Mm. We did it over no, we done it over two sessions actually. You're right, didn't we? Yeah. So it's more like three hours to write it. Um, and at the very end of it, you got to hear our very very, very rudimentary first, demo. Yeah. And uh, spoiler and sp alert! <laughs> spoiler alert! You can't actually hear that song yet. We haven't done it yet. But you will. Yeah, because it was going to go on the album we made. We we're going to make this year, but we didn't. We haven't made it yet. No, because as you said, spoiler alert. Yeah. Something came in and and, and toppled us yeah. from our album making cart. Exactly. Well, the album that we were originally going to make hasn't been recorded yet. We're still releasing a best of. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Which is interesting, right? Yeah. So that's quite fun. Um, so come on in, drop the bombshell. You dropped it already. Well, um, that's the, yeah. Now you're yeah. Well, you, you're, yeah so we signed up for the um, album writing club. Make an album in a month. We did. Um, and, but then this next song isn't even from that. <laughs> <laughs> bombshell. <laughs> Spoiler alert. That's the bombshell. We'll come back and talk about. It. Let's play the next yeah, song. Yeah. So this. Well, there is a bit of a story to this song, but we'll play it anyway. Yeah. Uh, this is called "The More You Learn, The Less You Know." It is. We released it as a single. We did. I'm gonna play it. Play it. Checking out the witch, stitching time On the line, surf straight up with a line Hit the cook's books for a fresher look Let the knowledge marinate into every nook Life's test the test, we have a go The more you learn, the less you know Since we exist, let's try to grow The more you learn, the less you know It's ups and downs, a wild show The more you learn, the less you know The more you learn The purse string theory, nothing's happening Waste resources reinforces this recycling No certainty on survival guarantee Malnutrition breeds service to the corporate greed Life is a test, let's have a go The more you learn, the less you know No one knows best, it's afterglow The more you learn, the less you know through ups and downs, we live the show The more you learn, the less you know The more you learn, the less you know Stacking hay, 
brains While the men with veins Get stats but the facts always misbehave Pop points got this man been a mother So confused now I'm in need of a cuddle We passed the test, we're good to go The more you learn, the less you know You place the bets, go with the flow The more you learn, the less you know Get Joel and Mike, go Tom and Crow The more you riff, the less you grow Fight or flight, or toe to toe The more you learn, the less you know Is that how Guy would say it? Yeah, maybe. It's not yeah. really beautiful, that song, is it? But it's educational. Yeah. Educational. If I feel like Guy Garvey's um, on helium. Is he? <coughs> well, he when you, quite when high, you do an when impression do of him, yeah. It's a bit like Jeff, it's right? Like, yeah, your beautiful was better. It's lower. Yeah. Like. Beautiful. That's still really high. Yeah, that's not... Yeah, yeah. No, I suppose it is. Beautiful. Yeah. I don't reckon he's done it that high, though. I don't too many syllables, yeah. isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Um, rubbish. Intellectual? No, no delete, delete it. The whole year gone. Delete it, gone. Cheers, guy. So anyway, yeah, the more you learn, the less you know. That was actually um, like a single we released then yeah. because we had... Well, what we were doing was we were making loads of Improv Squared music yeah. ready to send out to work with a whole bunch of people. Yeah. And then the bombshell came of, you know, you've got a month to make an album. So we're yeah. like, okay, Do you cool. want to sign up? We signed up. We signed up. We took on the challenge and we made an album in a month. Yeah. And uh, the next chunk of songs are going to come from that. Right, but so cool. So, But yeah, so this song was recorded as an improv squared yeah. to, to, be, to go towards the record. Uh, but that's the more you learn, the less you know. But we chose not to well, the put reason it was, out. So yeah, episode three, spoiler alert, of the um, making of an album podcast was about alternative writing techniques. If you go back and look in the year, you'll find our alternative writing techniques is episode. Is it a spoiler alert if we've already done it? <laughs> it's true. Like, it's spoiler alert, it. go and listen to this. It's like, that's not correct use of spoiler alert. A trowler? So like alert well, backwards? Just, just making up words. Yeah, right. just make okay. up some words. Okay, I like um, it. But yeah, so we were doing about alternative writing techniques yeah. and we were, you know, um, saying how great we were and coming up with Improv Squared. And the more you learn, the less you know was our example. So because right. like, we hmm. considered possibly saving it for our, our album. album in a month, but we we're like, well, actually, we've already kind of we've already made it, so yeah. we should we should drop it. But well, this came out before, yeah, just before that. Just, it was on the before month. It was in that month in May of May. We were we dropped it. Yeah, yeah, at the beginning of the month with a video. Mm, yeah, with, with a, a video, video, the Empire Square we video. Filmed ourselves. Yeah. And that is exactly how we made the whole record. So this was almost, as say, a song that was put forward for it, but we released it anyway. Yeah, because it was kind of before it. I mean, yeah. in fact, um, spoiler we, alert. I think we made the decision that it was like, oh, this isn't going to kind of feel... Well, it where, was, it was recorded record. at the same time musically as Money Poise and Hurricane Came. And right. They both did make the record. They did. But this was the first one I wrote, because so it was sort of before those songs went towards the... Um, 2 a.m. And yeah. Then okay, this yeah. one was already written before it, so yeah, we were like, yeah. okay, we'll we'll put it out with this. Yeah. As our example song. And then yeah, then we took a detour and did that. But yeah, um, we're going to take a different detour. Spoiler alert to the future, which is still the past. And yeah. it's here about a nun in a kayak. That's what I want to hear. I thought we were playing that later. We're, oh, we're playing that later. We've we've this guy. Oh, spoiler alert. Spoiler it's a alert. proper spoiler Terrible. alert. Like <laughs> an accidental spoiler alert, but that's the first one you've done that makes sense. <laughs> oh, um, dear, no, dear. before that, man, yes. we're going we're gonna to play. We got remixed this year. So it, during the album writing club, Maybe thing, we He's met lots of people. I came back. He's, He's back. back. I, I detoured. Um, we met a, a whole bunch of online. We met a whole bunch of awesome musicians. Yeah. And, you can go back and listen to our Lights and Lines special presentation where we played oh, a track by everybody every that song, entered the competition. Every single that was put forward, we played. And one of the <clears throat> awesome artists that entered the competition was the Moore Experiment, M-A-W Experiment. Mm -hmm. And um, we wrote to him. And Well, I wrote to him, you didn't write to him. It would have been confusing if he received emails from both of us. Yeah. 
It could have been quite cool we though. Soliciting him. Could have been quite intimidating, yeah. couldn't it? And we might have just given him the same information. Anyway, so I chatted to him and um, he agreed to remix some songs from Champignon Lumiere. Mm-hmm. He and did. He took badder decisions and. He did. Champignon Lumiere itself, I think, from he did. the best of the best of. And he, he did a four track remix. He did. Which he then put up. It's on Bandcamp and uh, the money goes to charity. Does it? Yeah. It goes to help people. Brilliant. Yeah. So do you want to play one of them? Yeah, I'm going to play one because us playing it, surely money goes to charity, right? Well, no, because our podcast is free. Nobody pays to listen to our podcast. Okay, but if you want to pay for a podcast, you can email. Go and buy this record. Go and buy buy the the more experiment versus Cosmic Gloss or Cross Cosmic Gloss, whatever it is. The more experiment, M A W experiment. Yeah, buy this all is, of his records yeah, are good. Of course, man. This uh, this is he here yeah, remix he done of us. This is like pretty cool. It's called Digital Breakdown. Yeah, I'm gonna play it. Play mate. it. Doing it. Experiment digital breakdown remixed has it remixed it um mate you mentioned none in the kayak I did as a spoiler so I'm gonna play it okay do it this is it I'm in a kayak on a day of five lake going it alone was the biggest mistake up a level, cis-tented way, so 
circling solo civic systems break Getting halfway and turning back quick She ate all the carrot and then ate the stick When the palindrome calls her home Of the sea, a blip on a radar is all she might be. Bob up a level, all ten it be gone. She did it alone, and nothing went wrong. Getting halfway and turning back far. All future decisions were made in the past If the palindrome gets her home, she'll be amazed Reliving the wow till the ending of day in a kayak and he's just did you hear that yeah oh, yeah it's peaked <laughs> yeah why are you still doing oh, that oh yeah I was just uh, if you're having a long hard day podcasting make sure you drink a Jimmy's iced coffee uh, Mo- mocha N- Nick and Andy's preferred is the mocha but yeah. they also do a latte nice not I've a lot B though only a latte I've had a latte as well and it's pretty good Mm. But Jimmy's iced coffee is pretty good. So, of all the iced coffees, it is the Jimmy's favourite. It's, it's the most my Jimmy. favourite. Plus, it's called Jimmy. Exactly. Like Jimmy, which makes me think of like Jimmy McGill, which um, makes me think of Better Call Saul. So, as a, this is the best of the year. I know we're mainly talking about music. Cosmic Boss and uh, yeah. how great we are. But, uh, what's been your favourite TV show this year? It's oh, yeah, a tough one, but probably Better Call Saul. Ah, uh, yeah, Jimmy yeah. McGill. I'm, I'm done with that. Beck was one yeah, of, it's one of the uh, most amazing things I think I've ever seen on TV. Yeah. I think, um, yeah, same with Breaking Bad. But it's Be- better than Breaking Bad. Oh, well, I agree. Yeah, wow. We're, um, we've obviously, had, this would be a controversial topic that people would argue on a podcast, but yeah. we're in total agreement. So, so there's no argument. Do you want me to pretend? No. No, cool. No. Oh, I wasn't going to be very good at it. So, so if you haven't seen Better Call Saul, spoiler alert, it's amazing. Is that I a didn't, spoiler? Well, I mean, you might be watching thinking, you know, it could be rubbish. But no, 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 oh, it no. nails the ending. That's the important thing. Like, TV shows that don't yeah. nail the ending, it's annoying. Yeah, agreed, yeah. And Better Call Saul absolutely nails the ending. It's amazing. Yeah, it's great storytelling. If visually, like, I'm real. Yeah, man, Better Call Saul, that's our shout-out for the favourite TV show of the year. Look at that. It's boss. It, that was What was best of favourite TV show of the year, do you reckon? I reckon it was probably um, Big Mouth. And that is also pretty good. Yeah, that's, and that, that's, that's been coming out for and the last Resources, few years. Human Resources, that came out this year, didn't it? It did as well. That's, that's pretty, best of. pretty good, yeah. He likes the besides, doesn't he? He does. So. There's been some great shows this year. Yeah, hell yeah. So, None in a Kayak, mate. Yep. What was that all about? It's all about palindromes. 
Yeah. That's all part of the spoiler alert for the uh, Music Weekly stuff that comes to up towards the end of the year. But we'll, we'll come back to talk about that. Um, we just chucked that song in the middle there just to uh, yeah. you know, be confusing. Yeah. You know, well, it, okay, so it's like it's that the song itself was a spoiler alert. Yeah. But then, yeah. And I mean, it's, your, well, your spoiler alerts are still the best thing I've ever heard. Though. Really? That's yeah. terrible. Um, so, yeah, that's been on then. So Easy. In April? Is it all May? In May, we made an album in a month. And, uh, yeah. yeah, spoiler alert, we won a Judge's Choice Award for it. Yeah. Um, why again, why spoiler alert? It? Just like, in case we've already sure told we've that information. It. Oh, yeah, I suppose. So it's not a spoiler if we've already told them. Yeah, so um, we put out a single from that. <laughs> yeah. We just play it. It's called Catch a Clue. Okay. <laughs> yeah, had a video as well. <laughs> it was us doing uh, karaoke. Spoiler, spoiler alert. <laughs> Tightrope tie, but the gap's too wide It's falling from grace on the rapid side Course on the horse of catastrophe Tumble on, I come down from pure ecstasy Up sport, it's all the shifting. Multiverses all coexisting. Nothing short of everything missing. Take a moment, catch a clue. Beautiful. 
Catch a clue. Yes. Um, that's a, that's one of um, that's one of our best songs of the year. Yeah, it is. That's why I made the best of. It did. Yeah. I, as as I was saying, about to say that, I thought, of course it is. It's on best of. Yeah, yeah. But I said it anyway. That's that's one of my favourites. Yeah. It's um, it's one of my favourites too. It was yeah. a really fun one to do. I remember pitching to you the idea. It's like I wanted to do this kind of fast talkingy thing, and you initially were like, mm. "Yeah," and I was like, oh, "Let me try it." Yeah, and yeah, that and came, went all right, and that's what happened. Yeah, yeah, I do remember that. I remember because this is a piece of music um, that we had before, right? Mm-hmm. So we kind of had messed around with a melody. In fact, we had a melody for the chorus with different words originally. Something old, something bubble, something blue. Which I think we, we put we in there at some point as just well. as, a, yeah. as a reference to the original. Yeah. Spoiler um, alert. That is, see, good spoiler alert, but you said spoiler alert after you'd said it. So like, you've done the right Still thing the wrong way around. So it's good, it's good. Um, yeah, so a piece of music that we kind of already, yeah, and then you went, took it away, wrote it, some lyrics and done the talky thing. And I was like, Okay, cool. Let's run with it. And it is pretty catchy. It did take me a few takes to get it, didn't it? And I think there's already, in the, even in the actual take, there's a couple of slip-ups. Yeah. I think that's also good, though. I it's quite like that. It. it makes it a bit real. Like The video is also great. Mm. One of the funniest videos to make oh, with you. Galactic shout-out to Dana for the keytar. Uh, absolutely, Dana. That was the key part to the, uh, to the Seagulls. video. <laughs> Seagulls. Um, yeah. I love playing that as well. Even though I didn't actually play it, I just mined it. It looked awesome. Did it look it like, like you were playing it? Yeah. Did it actually? It did, yeah. I mean, I, when I watch the video, I think you're playing it, even though I know you're not. Uh, I mean, certainly, the more sober Nick is trying to play it actually properly, but the drunk Nick at the end, he's lost it. He's lost control. Oh, yeah. That's it. Spoiler alert. We get steadily drunker throughout the video. Good. But spoiler alert. If you haven't seen the video. Yeah, if you haven't seen the video, we've spoiled it good. for you now. That's good. That was a good spoiler alert. I'm proud of you. Oh, should we uh, just play some more songs? Yeah, well, let's stick to the album. So this is all from the next few songs are going to be from the album. 2 a.m. Mu- it's Mission Time. In a month challenge, yeah. 2 a.m. It's Mission Time. We released it back in August. Yeah. So we've only put out two albums and an EP this year. Only? Yeah, and a live, Boss Live 1. At the Boss Live week, 1, yeah. Which we haven't included any songs from because it's technically last year. Yeah. We, um, we treated it as yeah, last year. Yeah, we treated it as yeah. last year. But our submission to the singles playlist was Isle of Avalon. It was. And that was the theme of the record when we were making it, was Glastonbury. Yep. And uh, so, yeah, but spin Isle of Avalon. Let's hear it. I want to hear it. Okay. Do you want to hear it? Yes. <laughs> Still forevermore 
secrets kept in store I'll forget the next round in Tables turning for the king Jesus left the grail here In the fairy caves of Amwin The Glastonbury Abbey monks Sing histories through song In the Isle of Avalon Some crazy ass synth playing in yeah. it from you, I imagine. Uh, yeah. Um, I, yeah, playing it with my ass is, is, is difficult to do, but it, it gets some amazing results. The crazy ass playing, yeah. When you mute like 95% of the notes that are being played and you yeah. find the good one, find it, the one note that's good, that good note, yeah. I think that's if you are if you play keyboard with your your ass and you record it, you'll always be amazing, yeah. And and it, live is quite difficult to do it. It scares people off when you pull your pants down to start playing. Why do you have to do it naked? You, you should not be playing synths with your ass if it's Full not naked. Stop. How can you feel it? You need to feel the keys. Trust me. <laughs> you need to feel those Trust keys. Trust you, you need to and, feel and those plus, keys. And plus, every note then is a bum note. Yeah. <laughs> hey, Easy goes. goes. Look at that. That was beautiful. It was like I've written that. Absolutely terrible. beautiful. Did you write it? No. Good. I didn't write it down. Yeah, that's good. Waste of ink. Well, no, I liked it. It was quite funny. And why am I putting ink on my phone? That's really stupid. So, Isle of Avalon, mate. Yeah. Single, single choice. Yeah. Um, didn't win. Didn't, didn't win the single. Didn't win the single. That thing. went to Mikey J. Mikey J. Shout out, Mikey J. Out yeah. of Galactic, shout out to Mikey J. Um, and my, my little, little dragon, dragon girl. girl. My little dragon girl. Yeah, man. Yeah. Yeah, that's cool. He done well. He won the singles thing. Good for yeah. him, man. I hope he's. Uh, I hope he's rocking out somewhere. He is, doing his he thing. is in Australia, rocking out. That plays bass. I see and stuff. I follow him on socials and yeah. whatnot. Yeah, man. Good for him. Massive shout out to him. Massive. So, right. So we're gonna um, like play some more songs. Yeah. Should we? Should we go back to Joe? To Joe. Yeah. Well, I haven't got a Joe song next. Why not? I got what this song. I think you're missing one then. What is? Are you thinking of W I I? W I I? No, you moved oh, it. Moved Wait, it. <laughs> <laughs> spoiler well, alert! I didn't pay any attention to when we were doing right, the prep before, for this. Before we made the podcast, before we set all of this up, we're like, right, we'll just pick the order of the songs. <laughs> Andy picked the order and, <laughs> and then, then changed, changed the order. <laughs> and hasn't noted himself for changing the order, so yeah, screw we changed him. the order. I'm going to play the next song, which is called Patient Mystery. It's the one you sing, isn't it? I sing it. Oh, it's me singing. Yeah, it's next singing. It's probably the best song yeah, on the best of. So why isn't this on best of's best of? Yeah, it is on best of. Yeah, yeah. But he's got a version of you singing it. Wow. He's got the demo, even though you didn't record the demo. <laughs> you did, I record, did record, a record a demo. I had to learn yeah. the lyrics somehow. Did. Yeah. You did record So yeah. best of's got that version. Yeah. So if you want to hear the best of version of this, you need to check out best of's best of. But otherwise, check out this best of version with Nick singing of Page of Mystery.
the great pretend It wastes the life if you're gonna change Smile with every step that you are going to take Hold on to the mystery And let go of the misery Pick yourself up and try again Again Disappointment understated Ration out the passion Changes back in fashion Always keep playing, never cashing Still back to basics when you reach the end But don't give in to The Great Britain Life if you're gonna change Smile with every step that you are going to take Hold on to the mystery Let go of the misery Pick yourself up and try again Again, again I don't think we can solve this one Embrace the life if you're gonna change Smile with every step that you are going to take Hold on to the mystery And let go of the misery Pick yourself up and try again Again I think I think it'd be a good idea to get Guy Garvey to record himself saying that for us. And do you think he'd mind us using it? Are oh, we using it? Well, until he allows us to, we're, we're going to do I'm pretty it. sure if we search for Elbow Live, we can like, find it. Most of the time he does it. I know, but I don't want to steal it. I want, his, I want him mm. to like. I want Guy Garvey, like if you Guy. listen, if you Guy. listen to our podcast, can you send us a. Just anything. Beautiful. Just send us a text and be like, hey, what's going on? I listen to you, and that would be like pretty cool in that itself. Would, that would blow my mind. You I don't know if would I could it, handle would it, what your your mind would explode. Well, I, I, I don't know. I'd fanboy all over Guy Garvey. Really? He's, he's too much of a legend so in if my you, mind. If you met him, would you not be cool? <sighs> I, I, I got a feeling diff- that I'd, I'd be like, um, spoiler alert, if it, for an old Adam and Joe podcast. <laughs> <laughs> Do you remember when what? in Adam and Joe? Just yeah. Quickly, yeah, when yeah, but why are you spoiling the podcast that came out over a decade <laughs> just ago? Just in case people haven't heard it yet, I'm spoiling it for right. them. Oh, okay. They might, it might be the next episode they're going to listen to. Yeah, okay. Well, there's one where they're talking about Joe Cornish meeting Roger Moore and yeah, he, yeah, he yeah, couldn't handle yeah. meeting him. Yeah. And he went mute and went. Mm. He was, yeah, his, yeah, he was all over the place, wasn't he? Yeah. And my fear is that that would be what I'd be like with Guy Carvey. I, d- I reckon you're... Um, I'm cooler than that, you reckon? I don't think yeah, you're yeah, cooler than it, Joe yeah. Cornish. No, I'd say you're like I'm maybe a bit more Cornish. like... No, definitely not, man. Joe no. Cornish is a, an absolute hero. Absolutely. Like, uh, but yeah, I, I think you're, you're a very different person to him. I think you, you'd handle it. You'd be cool. You would be cool about it. Like, okay, cool. Thanks. Um, My wife does not think I would be. She's definitely like, no, you'd be a gibbering record. No, guy. I think you'd be like, mate, I think... <laughs> I want to let you probably go... Be- <laughs> to him and then that will hopefully make him laugh and then boss job done it oh but yes make him laugh but yeah guys send us a version of that we love you guys and just get in touch it'd be lovely to hear from you because we're massive fans right of, of shout, all out, elbow. shout out elbow all, all you guys in elbow oh, not yeah, just guys all the guys of elbow all the guys of elbow all the guys in elbow all the guys in elbow, all the guys in elbow. <laughs> What, what was that <laughs> it was my version of <laughs> independent woman <laughs> of course <laughs> 
the, the, the elbow. <laughs> So oh rather, than sing, rather than single ladies, it was <laughs> all the guys with elbows. <laughs> There's a lot of guys in elbows. Yeah, yeah, there is. They it's were wicked them. live as well. They were, they were amazing live, yeah. That was I mean, actually fact, last year. That was last year, one of the best gigs I've ever been to. Um, like, If you like elbow, then go and, and you haven't seen them live, watch them live. Right? They were amazing. Um, mate, spoiler alert, beautiful. Right, well, we've got a different kind of song to play next, mate. Yeah. How do you feel about this one? Um, I really like this next one so spoiler alert um, <laughs> <laughs> we'll be working with Andrew Archer on a lot in the future <laughs> oh dear we've broken ourselves um, no it's good so um, it's just yeah no carry on, carry so, on. Yeah, I mean, it's the wrong kind of spoiler alert but I is. like it I like it but we did uh, Andrew Archer is another person that we met through the album writing club yeah he is while making out. the album out of Galactic shout out to Andrew Hartshorn absolutely we even made a podcast about him we have the Andrew Hartshorn special check it out yeah it's out somewhere um, yeah just a couple over of, there a couple of podcasts before this best of that's it best of scroll best down of. scroll down a little bit there yeah, it is there it is oh hold on wait don't, don't listen don't. to this one the rest of this one first there's probably at least another like hour of us talking nonsense maybe maybe, maybe. Uh, but anyway yeah so we, uh, we did a, a remix of one of Andrew Hartshorn's songs we wrote a lyric for it and we did recorded a vocal we yeah. sent it to him he put out his own version and then we m- remixed it and put out our version so yeah his version is his piece of music with your vocal and then our version is his piece of music with your vocal and then we've added some stuff we have we've bossed it up it goes like this it came out on Virtual Normality 2 which came out in November, November. Yeah. Um, so like you can buy that if you want yeah, because like, we, you know, we do this for free at the moment, and yeah, and, you give know, us some money. Give us some money, we can buy some better stuff and do some cooler stuff and be better. Yeah. Um, but yeah, man, chat out Andrew Harsh on this is a fat tune. Yeah, I'm gonna play it. Play okay. it. I'm waffling. False promises. Stop me. Stop. Thanks. <laughs> Whiskey in a teacup, the wishes in the jar, a fantasy in transit, the went a step too far. But time's a one way ticket that always ends in dead. Waiting on a no show is all we did instead of living. Can't promise anything It could ruin everything I won't promise anything That could ruin everything Thinly veiled desire Honestly just won't fly Sort the wounds with tears You've dehydrated, hitly cried See me flaws and all A simple soul enigma Just trying to get by While blinded by the stigma I will promise everything Just to feel anything I have promised everything Just to feel something I liked it. Yeah. Good. It's That's beautiful. a good one. That's a good beautiful there. Mm. It didn't Thanks. peak as much as some of the I others peaked. Yeah, sorry, I was peaking my beautifuls. But it's all right. You, well, you peaked massively. But anyway, that's rubbish podcasting. False Promises. Yeah. Um, that's a great song. Andrew Hartshorn and Natalie Calhoun. 
on the cello. Shout out to those guys. Yeah. Big shout out. It's actually Natalie Williams Calhoun. We, we always drop her middle name for some reason. It's not a middle name. I mean, it's a double it's barreled. barreled. Double barreled surname. And Natalie Rocks. She put out an EP. For the, from the, the Unwriting Club. Club. Yeah, play cello, right? All cello. Oh, it's mate, all like, cello. It's amazing. These are the people that we're really pleased we've met. Oh, hell yeah. And have helped us and um, we're hoping to continue working with, right? And we've, we've, got some, shout out. we've got some ideas that we're going to be throwing their way. And yeah. Yeah, mate. Yeah, we are it's been a good year. It has been a very good year. Like, you know, festive season around the corner like it's nice to be celebrating a, a very good year probably the best year i think we've had i agree if it was a wine vintage this would be the year that people would want to bottle up and uh, put in their cellar for it's a later cellarable. Day. It's, it's cellar- a cellarable year it's cellarable, year. It's, cellarable it's one of those word? things in a hundred years people will pull out the dusty bottle of cosmic boss wine and go ah oh, the 2022 vintage this was a particularly good year for cosmic boss and if you drink it, you can hear our music? Yeah, it's how, how wine works in the future, man. Spoiler alert. Oh, wow. <laughs> Jeez. Okay, right. Good spoiler alert, except you said spoiler alert after oh. you told the thing. Damn it. I forgot. Okay. I thought so it was you either, conspiracy you either, podcast either, again. Yeah, yeah. But it's brilliant, because you either spoiler alert too soon about something you've already done, or you spoiler alert after the thing. It's brilliant. <laughs> spoiler alert for my <laughs> deep web podcast, uh, Cosmic Boss conspiracies without yeah. nick it's called it's called without it's nick called cosmic boss Spir- conspiracies without nick do i feature no. at all no it's without you okay you can't Ooh. listen to it either it's blocked if you try and search for it just me though yeah. or anyone called nick i spent all of our budget this year on building a special nick blocker so that you Is can't hear my secret nick, podcast though. anyone called nick no just you well yeah i'll just get dre to do it oh damn it easy well, i'll have to pay for the dre upgrade <laughs> <laughs> um yeah, so we're going to... Next song is from Back to 2am, right? We're going back to 2am. So so virtual normality is scattered around, isn't it? Mm. Well, there's only three. No, there's four. And there's four. Morning we're scattered coffee, around. Morning coffee, none in a kayak, false promises, and spoiler alert, Spaceship Earth. Yes. It's coming up later. You've done it right. You've done go. one right. Let's all give him a round of applause. Come on, then. That's the worst round of applause ever. Is that better? Yeah. Thanks, man. Uh, I mean, I'm holding my microphone, so it's quite difficult yeah. to do it. But, um, but well done on your spoiler alert uh, success. And uh, yeah, so we're going to go back to 2am. Yeah. This song's called Money Please. Yeah, it was, this was the second single. Yeah, this song's um, heavy. This song's yeah, heavy. It's great. Okay. Oh, yeah. I'm going to play it. Money Please. He's going to play it in a sec. He's going to play it. Protection 
makes us all face the wrong direction Early inception No bone of contention Sacred sites on lock and key Or forbidden entry Falcon is Maltese, money please Break down of community Distance and apathy Sell the sleaze, money please, money please Money, please. We wrote that song in a van. We or the did. idea in a van. We did. Driving. It's all about Mona Lisa from Parks and Rec. Spoiler alert. Oh no, it's not spoiler alert. You can. That's an old show. <laughs> <laughs> You're realising that. It's I'm good. starting to learn. We're, ste- we're stepping up. We're stepping <laughs> up. I'm like AI and the intelligence. It's developing <laughs> slowly. Yeah, slowly. Very what slowly. What are we talking about? Oh, um, yeah, Mona, Mona Lisa. Lisa. Mm-hmm. Um, um, one yeah. of my favourite characters or well, both of our favourite characters from Parks and Recreation yeah. she is the sister of Jean Ralphio who is also Who's one of the best right, characters yeah. um, they probably could have had their own show but yeah. it probably been really annoying they could yeah. have just sprinkled a little yeah, bit that's, it, that's why it works although both characters yeah you can't have they're so laugh out loud for the short periods that they're oh, on no, screen yeah. like you, to, to get 25 minutes out of that is but yeah, like amazing. Um, Parks and Rec, we've shouted that out loads of times. We're shouting out again. Last year we did shows. a Mike Shaw special. Sure. This year we did an Andrew Hart Sean special. Last year we did a Mike Shaw sure. special. Who's going to be our next? Shirley. Shirley. Someone called Shirley. Someone called Shirley. <laughs> Shirley Jackson. Who's she that? wrote. She's a writer. She wrote um, House on Haunted Hill. Wicked. The Haunting of Hill House. The oh, original yeah. book. Shirley Jackson. Yeah. Let's, let's interview her. Next, uh, next year. Oh, yeah, Look we'll out for the Shirley Jackson. Her. Shirley Jackson special. Surely not. We always do our specials. <laughs> Whilst drinking <laughs> Having slur. Having a slur. <laughs> and doing a <laughs> special. <laughs> yeah, but anyway. What are we talking about? Oh, yeah. Is that going to get a sponsor by slur? Hopefully. Jimmy's and slur. slur. If you're listening. We like drinks. Jimmy's, slur, Guy Garvey... Uh, who else Greg can hear Alison Bree Alison Bree if you listen to our podcast yeah. please contact us if we you love know you. Alison Bree or anybody who could get in touch with Alison yeah. Bree so just tell her that we are big fans we're massive fans of Alison Bree and we'd like her to listen to our podcast because yeah. that would be cool her Greg can hear uh, Guy Garvey yeah. um, I'm sure there's a f- handful of others but, but there are Ainsley the Harriet yeah all, oh, of these, all of these pieces, yeah. There's that great thing we discovered earlier this year, spoiler alert, about that song. What was it called? I've forgotten it. <laughs> <laughs> spoiler alert that you've forgotten. That's brilliant. Is it another chance or something? If I had another chance tonight, <laughs> I'd rather take a bath with Ainsley Harriet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. 
Yeah, that is. Uh, yeah. It, it, it really sounds like he's saying, I'd rather take a bath, bath with Angus and Harriet. Harriet. Maybe he is. He's not saying that. The oh. lyrics, it's, it's, it's not that. That's what you've been told the lyrics are, though. He, the original might have been. He's okay. written that. He's like, oh, but it sounds a bit more like this. I will pretend it's that then for you. Because taking a bath with Angus Harriet's a strange vocal line. Oh, it's pretty good. I don't know. I, you know. If that's what you're into, if you want to take bath with um, Harriet. with celebrity chefs, I think get their permission first, and then don't just surprise them in the bath. <laughs> no, always get permission. I think it's, it's it's important, you know, to be respectful. Who's so. that really shouty one? Gary Barlow. Oh no, Gordon Ramsay. Gordon Ramsay and Gary Barlow. If, if either of them are in a bath. And <laughs> I don't know where I'm going with this. Okay, I, <laughs> I'm going to stop. Shall I interrupt? <laughs> yeah, interrupt. Okay, mate, what are you talking about? <laughs> um, let's play another song, let's okay? Play a song. This song is also from 2 a.m. is Mission Time. Oh, you yeah. Go and buy that and whatnot. Um, I feel like I'm promoting the buy it now. Yeah, um, buy it now. Buy our record. It's, thing. it's good. Um, money, please. Money, please. Good work. You're learning. Um, this You're song. Nick Intelligence. This song, nigh. <laughs> this song is. Intelligence a, is nigh. <laughs> Come this, on. This song. Hurry up. <laughs> What's this song? This song is about one of our favourite comedians, a guy called Bill Hicks. Yes. Um, out of Galactic, shout out. Oh, Rest mate, yeah, what a hero. Um, this song's, uh, yeah, using him, yeah. about him, doing some stuff with him. It's called Here's Tom with the Weber. So high they let the slime breed If you have a message then you won't succeed And Hicks was armed with smoking shotguns Angels like that never give out refunds Hey Bill, you were right Turning on the vermin every single night I had a punchline so they maybe listen Open conversation is severely missing Yes, Bill, it's still true Disassociation, no one's got a clue What you're reading for, do you think you're clever? Life is just a ride, now here's Tom with the weather So high he was splitting mountains Overdose toast from the youthful fountains Like UFOs over backwards towns Show independent thought and they will hunt you down Hey Dave, let a man speak His message was important, just intensely bleak Rational thinking is a skill worth sharing Asking questions isn't being daring Hey Bill, we miss you Smoking up a teacup where the storm will brew What you're fighting for, why the soul endeavour Life is but a dream, now here's Tom with the weather How about a positive drug story on the news? Last night, a young man on acid realized that all matter is merely energy condensed to a slow vibration, that we are all one consciousness experiencing itself subjectively. There is no such thing as death, life is only a dream, and we are the imagination of ourselves. Here's Tom with the weather. Here's Tom with the weather Hey Bill, you were right Turning on the vermin every single night I had a punchline so they maybe listen Open conversation is severely missing Yes, Bill, it's still true Disassociation, no one's got a clue What you're reading for, do you think you're clever? Life is just a ride, now here's Tom with the weather Hey Dave 
let a man speak His message was important, just intensely bleak Rational thinking is a skill worth sharing Asking questions isn't being daring Hey, Bill, we miss you Smoking up a teacup where the storm will brew What you're fighting for, why the soul endeavor Life is but a dream, now here's Tom with the weather That song is labeled beautiful and it makes the best of the best of. Uh, Thanks, uh, best of. I'm pleased with that one. That's is. okay. Like, this is only the second time we've heard from you. So, what other songs are on your album? Uh, ensemble Story <laughs> and uh, <laughs> Shopping Your Home for Me. And uh, he saw me the weather and he catch a clue. The other ones have made my best of. Just the four, so far. four songs. And. Uh, another one. Okay, cool. I'll stop making you do that accent Thank now. you. Bye, best of. It's like a terrible Luigi <laughs> Mario. <laughs> it was bought about a few hours ago. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's right. I forgot. <laughs> I forgot it was in my brain anyway, today. Cheers, best of. See you later. Um, <laughs> bye, 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 bye. <laughs> that's his catchphrase. <laughs> his catchphrase. <laughs> What are you on about? <laughs> it's best of right. catchphrase. I've only, I can only apologise for Andy. Yeah? Best of catchphrases. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, we're putting this out, man. We should definitely delete this, but we're going to put it we're out. We're leaving it in. We're leaving it in. Best of's gone now. Okay, cool. After those two versions of his brilliant catchphrase. I um, wonder if he'll come back at the end for a spoiler alert. Maybe. He won't. <laughs> <laughs> that, <laughs> that is teasing a spoiler that <laughs> might happen. <laughs> like that doesn't know how it works. It's not as rubbish. Yeah, oh, he'll God. definitely be back. I've probably forgotten what his yeah. catchphrase is. What is it? <laughs> the pasta! Give me the pasta! Pesto! <laughs> Pesto! <laughs> oh, oh stop it. Stop it. Well, that okay. song was about comedians, so it's good that we've afford and laughed afterwards because yeah. Bill Hicks was a very funny man he was a very very serious man but Extremely. he was also one of the funniest comedians ever extremely funny man yeah. so um, very wise well I think we should crack on and plan another song I think you're right yeah Yeah. right cool Bill from Bill Hicks we love you from Bill Hicks one out to back to shout out to another back to Joe yeah Joe is it Philogene time let's go Whatever you say it is, it isn't. It's from 2am, it's mission time. It's got Joe Philogene in it. It goes like this.
Oh yeah, that is a beautiful song. It is a lovely one. Um, amazing and Goni piece by Joe. Absolutely amazing. My favourite and Goni piece of the year. Yep. So out of, the, out of um, best ofs, that's the best of. That's best ofs, best, best of. Best of, Ungoni. best of, and Goni goes to uh, whatever you say it is, it isn't. Yeah. Thanks, mate. Thanks, best of. Good work, best. I mean, bestie. Bestie. Is he our bestie? Yeah, yeah. That's great. He makes the best ofs. He does make all the best ofs. He ex- does. Except this is his first best of. Yeah, it's his first. So he hasn't made them all. When did we invent him? Wasn't it earlier this year? I don't know. I can't remember. Oh, it doesn't matter. It's been a long year, though, isn't yes. it? Like, we've done a lot. We've put out a lot of podcasts. A lot, of, lot about podcasts. making an album that we haven't even made. Yeah, we, classic. we showed songwriting. Yep. We released uh, an album we made a month. We released the yep. uh, first imp of Squared. Yep. Released an EP. Yeah. What do you want? I, I don't want any more. Just this best of. Yeah? Yeah. Well, I want to tell you something that you wanted. Okay, what do you I really wanted want? to be remixed and you got remixed. Well Did we? we got we got orchestraled. Oh. Is that is, is that, that, is that, again? Is that like a remix? Yeah, he orchestralized it. Or just remixed it. Did he essentially? Well, we mixed it, but he done a. I, just I know he mixed where it. we are. We're in the middle of the Joe Philogene so special bit, aren't this we? Is Joe Philogene outro. Yeah. So that was whatever you say is isn't Mega Joe Philogene best and Goni of the year, and then the next is the best remix Joe and Goni of the yeah. year is this one. Wow. Remixed by Andrew Hartshorn. Who, Maybe. Spoiler yeah. alert! You heard earlier in False Promises. You heard it, man. You heard it right there. Yeah. Um, well, let's. I reckon we should play this because this is great. This yeah. is a. Uh, so we wrote, really released the song Quilt. Yep. Quilt, which was on our record to AM is Mission Time. Yep. Joe, uh, Joe it's is on Joe, it. Yeah. It's got Joe on it, and then Andrew Hartshorn like kind of done his own like orchestral remix. Yeah. This is how it goes. Bye. 
Famous words of Guy Garvey. Beautiful! Wishing right. Tune, man. Oh, it's Great amazing. tune. And he, like, that whole last, like, couple of minutes is all Andrew Hartshaw, yeah. right? Like, apart from your vocal, apart I think that's vocal, the only thing he's kind of yeah. kept in. The rest of it is all him. It's, it's Sounds awesome. great. Yeah, man. Mate, we, we shouted him out before, and we'll shout him out again the, right now. This has been a big year of Andrew Hartshaw. Um, yeah. It's been amazing. Yeah, listen to his music. Yeah. Give him some love. Give him some money. Money, please. Money, please. We want money, please, as well. You can please. support his label. He's got his own label. He has. Do you remember Monoc- the name of it? Monochrome Motif. Well, not Monochrome Rabbit. Right. Which uh, again, which we got to apologise for that. That was a, a stupid idea. And I apologise. <laughs> anyway, it's, it's in the past now. Yeah. It's spoiler forgiven. alert. Let bygones be bygones. Thanks, man. Well, listen, mate. This has been super fun. And I'm going to play you another song oh, to yeah, keep it being one. super fun. You, sure? Wait, you, you panicked. You got it in the right order. Yeah, I'm sticking at the yeah, order. Yeah, I got it in the right order. order. You panicked. You panicked. Panic. Listen, man, I'm in charge of this ship, yes. right? I'm sorry, I should have I'm in charge of this ship. Master producer. I'm the one that's flying this ship, all right? Yeah. This ship's called Spaceship Air. Oh, this is from Virtual Normality too. You've slept too long The alarm suggests Something's wrong There's a crack in the cryostasis It's classified and on a need-to-know basis Looks like the starship is on autopilot But let's face facts, no One knows how to fly it 
we're just all in a constant tailspin How do we get ourselves out of this mess we're in? It's planet size with no way to steer Let's all hope we don't hit any asteroids, my dear The course of history changed in a blip We're just the passengers on the Earth spaceship Seated here quite a long time ago The solar panels under the sea will all glow We try to break it with all that will work Massive damage to our home Spaceship Earth The maintenance crew We've got far too much to do Let's keep our cabins clean and tidy Pretend that we've got an inspection on Friday Twenty bodies to a single bird Economy class on Spaceship Earth Let's treat our ship with a little more respect From the captain down to the lower deck Cause if the engine ever blows a gasket It's hell time for us Without a hand basket Beautiful Earth spaceship Sorry we treated you so badly Beautiful Earth spaceship We love you Beautiful Earth spaceship Kind of, you, guy guy. you kind of done that in the song. Yeah, you did. actually done guy in the song with that. That's great. Um, special event, man. That's one of my. Um, Is one it your of best ofs of the year? It's one of my best ofs. Best ofs. Yeah, best yeah, yeah, of. it's on it. Should we check with? Should we check with best? No, like, look, yeah, my best ofs EP. EP best ofs best of is irrelevant. It is. It's no, the same as ours, except it's, he's got an ensemble no, story. Ones. Yeah, only a couple. Story. And shopping on Olivia. His, 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 his best of is also way shorter than ours, which suggests that he doesn't like us that much. Well, he, he picks the best of. The best of. The best of the best. But, but ensemble story didn't make our best of, and he picked it. Yeah. That's, that's, a, that's a silly that's idea. Yeah. But in, he's a bit like New Music Saturday then, because last, last year, New Music Saturday played Eyes, which... Was oh, nice. ne- didn't make our best of, <laughs> so that was Doctor Bones's. Really, and Mike Five's best of. They chose Eyes, which featured Anya Louisa, mm. which yeah. we didn't feature on our best of. We, we featured Anya Louisa, but we didn't feature. Yeah, there Eyes. were two songs we we've had singing that were way spoiler better. Spoiler alert: yes. Aim and Waiting. It's not a spoiler alert because yeah, the song was called Spoiler out. Alert. Oh, the song spoiler. Oh, yeah, I forgot about that I one. Forgot sorry. about that song. Yeah. Spoiler alert. Spoiler alert doesn't exist. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. Well, shout out Anya, right? She's still doing her thing. Yeah, She's still making music. I said, but then that last song, Spaceship Earth, was from Virtual Normality Two. Yeah, which was the EP we put out uh, towards the end. Towards of the, the end of the year, yeah. That was a fun five pieces of music to play with, right? Yeah. And False Promises, Andrew Hartshorn's song that you heard earlier, that was from that too. Yeah. As well as None in a Kayak and Morning Coffee, so the opening track. It is. Tell me about them. Okay, they were all written as part of the Music Weekly's hashtag challenge that yeah. they do weekly, hence the name Music Weekly's. They set a hashtag, and you've got to write a song about a ba- make a piece of music about that hashtag. Easy. And uh, if you if you want to play the game we invented, we do you want to come up with a new uh, theme tune for it, even though we're not using it now. Um, yeah. Yeah. Why not? I can't remember what that was. I remember okay. now. Yeah. Ready? Go. Yeah. Okay. G- g- guess. Gotta. Guess the hashtag. Gotta guess hashtag. You gotta guess what gotta, the hashtag is. It, yeah, you gotta, is, gotta, gotta, gotta guess it, the gotta hashtag. Guess it, What's guess the hashtag? It, I do not know yet. Guess it, yeah, guess, guess it. it. Yeah, guess there it. you go. 
kiss it, kiss it, kiss it. I'm gonna, gonna kiss it, kiss it, kiss it, kiss it, kiss the hashtag. Kiss, 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 kiss. Yeah, I'm gonna kiss the hashtag. Kiss, 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 kiss. Going on too long. Yes. Just guess it. Guess it. Good. That was one of the best theme tunes we've ever done, I reckon. That's perfect. Yeah, I think it says what it, we want them to do. So guess the hashtags, yeah. Okay, so I've got to guess the hashtag. You you already did. You, oh. you already played the... If you go back... Oh, I know. Bit, you go back and listen to the episode. <laughs> you didn't even know that was the thing. <laughs> so what the hell? Okay. Um, yeah. You still a spoiler alert. You can say spoiler alert because it's like if they, if they haven't heard they that haven't first heard it. and then you're spoiling... Like, if it's like it's a rubbish spoiler alert. It's like, are you enjoying this waffle? Well, I'm going to spoil that we do this earlier. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so you might not enjoy it then. Yeah, if you go okay. back and listen to it, you'll be like, "Oh, they already Spoiler. did this later." Yeah, okay, yeah, that's true. Yeah, they already did this later. How have we we made that <laughs> sentence make sense? <laughs> we all, they already did this later. God, they already did this. That's later. an album title, right there, isn't it? That's they what we'll, did this our later. next album. Spoiler alert! It's they already, called, did, they this already did this later. Could be. It could be next year. Can we call it spoiler alert? Can yeah, hundred percent. So if if you're listening and you think we should name one of our albums spoiler alert then uh, just email s- us well just say yes live like now say it go oh my god did you hear that I heard like no one say yes but in the future <laughs> somebody. if someone randomly we'll just be walking around and you'll hear in your head yes <laughs> or like somebody someone could be walking them. along the street now and then somebody else is walking along and they look each other in the eyes and just as we're saying to one of them I would say yes and he just looks that person in the eye and goes yes and then yeah. what carries on walking wow. we've affected that, the universe that would be the only interaction they've ever had with that person is it like you know when a, a butterfly flaps its its little wings it causes a hurricane um, spoiler alert we didn't put hurricane in the best of I bet that made best of best of yeah, we had a song called hurricane yeah. hurricane came why actually. didn't that make it that's one of my favourites why isn't that on it it's on Nick's best of it's oh, not yeah. on best of's yeah. best of All this is, uh, this is Cosmo else? Boss's best of yeah it's collective okay. I mean, it's collective, but I, I but Hurricane, I literally liked that didn't make it. I well, yeah, kind of I mean, feel like it's not collective, mate. Well, I, know, I mean, let's face it, Astral Underwear is neither of our favourites, but that made it. Yeah, why? Because <laughs> Best of liked it. Oh, right, <laughs> he okay. didn't even put it on his Best of. Yeah. <laughs> he put the she beast on the beside. Oh, God, oh Best God of. Damn you, Best of. What were we talking so, yeah, about? Music Weeklies, yeah, so so a few of the songs from Virtual Normality 2 come from this, and we're gonna, you're going to continue to keep making songs every week. Yeah. Um, that's going to roll on to next year. We're going to see where that takes us. Do some. Yep. So spoiler alert. Some come, come back in January next year. We're going to announce what it is we're doing, and we're yeah. going to put on a, a big, long, a year-long music challenge. That's next year, though, man. That is that's next, next year. year. This, this is, is the best. This, this is the best of this year. year. So let's celebrate this year. Okay. Okay. Or last well, year, if you listen to it in the, in the future. Year. Yeah. Only if you listen to next year. Or the year before, if you're listening to it the following year. Yeah. So if, you, if you're in 2024, yeah, it's two years ago. That we did yeah, all this. technically, yeah. or you, yeah, oh, technically year, okay. year, yeah. It depends when you're listening to it. What year are you listening to it? Just shout out now. <laughs> so twenty twenty four. Now some strangers walking past somebody, yeah. looking them stare in the eyes, and they shout twenty twenty four to them, and they go, "Yeah, that's this year. Well done." And they go, and "Yeah, they carry on." Thanks. It's, it's beautiful. Cause it's it's the metaverse, man. This is what's going to happen in the future. Everyone will actually answer the questions in podcasts. Yeah. Yeah. Reckon. yeah, cool. No, I don't reckon, but anyway, yeah, no, it's, good, it's a good try, though. It's a good try. So, anyway, we got covered this year, didn't we? we so, we uh, got uh, re connect, connecting into the Music Weeklies thing as well. I was introduced to the Music Weeklies thing uh, by um, Trench Gun, who Ooh. was Trench Gun was one of the um, uh, to participants, guys. yes, participants because it's a couple of guys, I think, um, in the album writing club. In fact, they had the opening track, didn't they? Bayonet, they did, yeah. something. Yeah, they Bayonet really, surprise. They released Bayonet that the well early. Yeah, 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 man. They, they, were, cool. they were on Met, it. They're metal, and they're metal. awesome. And they did and a cover. Heavy. They did a cover of one of our songs. They did. We we've not been covered before, and we now haven't. we have been the first ever cover. So this yeah. year we've had we've been remixed, we've been orchestrated, and we've covered. Been covered. And quick, sh- quick, super out of galactic shout out to Trench Gun, right, Massive for supporting and for doing this and. Let's keep making some music, right? We love you, Trench Gun. We're going to play your song, or Here our song, but you playing it. This is uh, Trench Gun's cover of whatever you say it is, it isn't. A song you heard a little while ago. Yeah. Okay, okay cool. No, I'm going to play it. Trench Gun's version. And then play Thanks it. for explaining everything I just explained. Well, you know, just in case they weren't listening. Harsh. Oh,
it's insane. It's nuts. Like amazing. Good, like that's great, right? That's that is so extreme from the original. Yeah. Like that's why I love it. Yeah, it's, it's, it's a proper insane. cover. And like somebody's listened to the words and played some yeah. insane drumming. Yeah, like, it's great. It's great. Thanks, Trench Gun. Yeah, you rule, Trench Gun. Right. And thanks for, you know, it's nice to meet people that were doing this competition. We've met lots, made some friends. Right? Yeah, let's, do our, some let's do our shout outs. We're, well, we're, we're at the yeah. end now, aren't we? Well, we're, this is the end. This yeah. is the end of this year. Yep. Are you ready to see out 2022? I am. Are you it's ready to bring in 2023? I'm excited for what 2023 is going to bring. <laughs> Me too. And 2022 has been, as you already said, a, a really great year for us. Yeah, big as, time. As you would have heard throughout this best of. Mm. And we've made a lot of fun fun tunes. Uh, yeah, made some music, done some podcasts, had some fun. Worked with some great some people. people. So, obviously, made let's an album, go through. Made an, album, made an album in a month. That's one of the best months, I think, of the year. And, and that was where we met a lot of people. So, let's, well, let's, should we do that with those people first? No, I feel like you want to shout people out. I like, do. Okay, let's shout, shout people, people out. out. Look, this is the year long, this is a 2022 shout out. Oh, so every shout out is Outer Galactic, by the way. Outer okay. Galactic. Yeah, he's okay. Shout to Galactic. We're going to take shout out to Galactic. Shout to Galactic. Shout out to Galactic. We're going to shout okay. out to the Galactic. Okay, so let's let's try and do one each at a time. Bye 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 bye. Let's do one each. Okay. We're going to see our best of mate. Leave us alone. <laughs> oh, however, <laughs> okay, let's start. I'm going to start. We're going to take it in turns. Okay, so who we're shouting out out Galactic? First of all, I'm shouting out Galactic. Best of mate. Good guy. Best of. Yeah, he, yeah, he's part of the show. Yeah, yeah thank you very much <laughs> for my shout out. Where the very fuck nice. is? <laughs> okay, well, I'm, yeah, my first shout out to Galactic goes to Joe Philogene. Has to respect, he is, um, respect to massive Joe. legend. We love yeah. you, Joe. Um, um, we're going to shout out uh, Dana. Dana for the, Howcroft. For the lyrics. Dana Howcroft. Yeah, yeah, big shout out. Massive shout out to Dana. You rule, Dana. We love you, uh, Andrew Hartshorn. Harsh on, yeah. yeah, and and Natalie Williams Calhoun. Okay, you could have got two there, but you took two. Um, ma- um, the more experiment, oh, got more shout experiment, out the more experiment, yeah. right? So, so like trench gun, then so yeah. shouting out trench gun. Okay, yeah, cool. Yeah. I'm gonna shout out Bill Hicks. Bill Hicks. That's Whoa, I'm gonna go back to the album um, writing club, and we'll, we'll do uh, Mikey J and Mike Five. Got shout out Mike Mikes. Five. Really, shout out all the mics. Okay, I'm gonna shout out you. Shout me because you've. You've been pretty good this year, oh, mate. Oh, thanks, man. Uh, I'm going to shout out you out then. Out of all the year. Thanks, man. Like, yeah. This has been a pretty good year from you. Yeah, but equally, there's lots of other people we've, we've forgotten to shout out, I think. From yeah, the but I just, I just want to shout out you first, man. Rebel Tramp. We, who's, uh, we Walked the Earth. They won yeah. it. They won the actual Yeah, thing. We Walked the Earth. They, re- they, they won it. Also. Rebel Tramp on the album, or, uh, EP, sorry. Yeah. And, and then we won Judge's Choice. Al Warren. Al Warren. AC Warren. Awesome. Yeah. He's amazing. So we're shouting out everyone from the album, right? Yeah, so basically, as like many of them as we let's, can. let's just shout Ray them all Cameron, out. We shout them all out. Yeah, we shout all of you out. Um, all of you. Yeah, yeah Kiffy, like, Kiffy, and Kiffy, your faithful yeah. five. Like all Dr. of them. Dr. Bones from all New Music them. Saturday. Massive and, shout out yeah, to him. Tex Shaman, what a legend. Right, so now it's just you saying everybody we've ever met. Well, no, it's not everyone. We, I mean, we didn't work with Tex Mix this year. We were we were planning to. Um, yeah, but we didn't. We we've, we've unfortunately got bogged down with making albums in a month. But don't worry, Tex, we will hook you up for sure. Yeah, yeah. You rule. So. We love you. Um, I want to shout out Theo. Theo. Um, quickly, Theo, for video starring mainly, Patient yeah. Mystery. Um, but he's been, like, he's featured in quite a lot of so stuff. So I want to shout out your wife. My wife. Trey. Trey. Andrea Jackson. She Why? rules. She's amazing. And oh, she, she gave birth to Theo. And this year she gave birth to Jasper. She did. She's going to be the next double, phase of our music. Double birth. Well, I'm going to shout out your wife then, oh, Abby, oh, and probably nice. like for putting up with our nonsense yeah. and uh, being behind a camera quite a lot, mm. and genuinely just being a bit of a ledge while she, we while we shout out Mella Macy. Uh, Mella Macy got married Mella this Mace, year. Mella Macy got married this year. That's it, a big so it's year. actually Mel and Chris. Macy, they are the Macys. Yeah, no, but it's, he's Macy, right? Yeah, yeah. He's we, Macy. Uh, we, He'll we, always be Macy twice. We um, we went to a wedding and started calling Mel Macy and Macy Chris, <laughs> and like the joke was hilarious. He absolutely hated it. It was brilliant. <laughs> yeah. And then the next morning, everyone was like, "Morning, Chris." It was brilliant. <laughs> Massive um, shout out to the, the Macys. Macy's yeah. yeah, and shout out to Jasper. Sorry, I know we chatted about, but like, yeah, my wife gave birth to another boy, yeah. little Jazz. Um, so yeah, big shout out to him. That's been a big thing this year. Yeah. And yeah, man, shout out to anybody making music, doing a thing. Yeah. Like, thanks for coming to be a part of our year. And uh, hopefully you'll come yeah. back next shout year. Shout out to Donnie Stacks. We shout out to Donnie Stacks. Donnie Stacks. That was a bit of a mistake. 
we featured Donny Stacks on Petit Champignon de Lumiere on a yeah, track called Magic Fun Guy. Shout out Donny. Um, it was an explicit track, which is why it didn't make the best of, because we didn't want to offend anyone. Yeah, we don't like swearing. Yeah, and that contains some oh, harsh swears, like yeah. tripping balls, isn't it? No, that's all right. That's fine. Yeah, you're allowed, that's to, trip fine. Over you're balls. allowed to trip balls. It's yeah, a health like, and safety thing. I'm tripping balls, is that? Yeah. yeah. I'm tripping on balls. Yeah. Like, put the balls away. Yeah. I got, shouldn't I, be tripping I got to tidy on. up. Yeah. That's a tidy up song. It's a song about it's you should about tidy up. Yeah. Yeah. If you're tripping on balls. Yeah. Well, mate, I think uh, we should wrap this year up because it's been great. I want to roll in 2023. Yeah, quick shout out to all the uh, Music Weekly guys as well. Shout out. We're going to be more connected. You can't get enough shout outs. I like shouting people out because people rule. Yeah, Um, I agree. I agree. And I agree. I agree. I'm not like dissing the shout Mm. out. I'm saying you've got a lot of people to shout out. Oh, shout out to Jimmy's. Shout out to Jimmy's sponsoring us. Jimmy's Jimmy's iced coffee. I finished mine. And something we used to do in the past was review tea. Um, we haven't done that for a while because yeah. it's so so like 2019 and yeah it's quite Q&T. funny though it is quite funny so instead I'm going to review a Jimmy's okay well, what do you think of the Jimmy's nice that was good mic technique man I like that <sighs> I think it is the finest iced coffee mocha that I've ever tasted this year brilliant and well, it wins my best of best of the year for iced coffees best of but that's best of version then not yours uh, Andy's best of best of <laughs> <laughs> just Jimmy's right yeah shout out to Jimmy if you want to sponsor us yeah please It'd be hopefully lovely. I mean we we are, we're, we are already sponsoring you as in we yeah, 100%, keep buying like, your drink, we, we so. love Jimmy's so like we're, I'm not ashamed to admit it so we're we're, we're sponsored we'll play up to you Jimmy's if you give us a lifetime supply of Jimmy's we will mm, I'd rather money really yeah give us money yeah money please how much money we'd save Jimmy's is well expensive well yeah but we'd we'd hopefully get more money than just what we could spend on Jimmy's (laughs) I want more money Jimmy's give me some money (laughs) give me some money please we'll we'll keep singing your praises we will we love you yeah anyway right let's wrap this nonsense up mate so okay let's do a a quick last (laughs) final out of galactic shout out (laughs) we've got to really haven't we because we're ending the year like this year um, unlike last year mate shout out to Ramdas that's quick. what I was going to do oh, is that what you were going to do oh, oh, just spoiler took... alert you oh, should have so spoiler sorry. alerted it so sorry you could have spoiler alerted I'm that so one, sorry I ruined it so anyway after all of my ribbing of you well actually I just kind of stole who you were, you were saying <laughs> a final shout out for the year <laughs> goes to Ramdas because he's provided us with multiple words of wisdom in the, the last couple of years and um, this is actually the only time we featured a word of wisdom this year was Ramdas. Yeah. With an awesome little story that he tells about a talking frog. Yeah. And it was from Petit Champignon de Lumiere. Yeah. Wasn't it? So yeah. with it, let's end it. Like the, oh, oh, well done. Do you, do you want to like, like, share, and subscribe? Yeah. yeah. Well, I already do. Comments. Comments. Likes, yeah, reviews. Share. Emails. Yeah, emails. Check out our link tree. Links tree. Yeah, what? link tree. We've got a tree. We've got trees oh, full wicked. of links. Wicked. You go on it and it links to everything. From Zelda. Yeah. Yeah, link, yeah, link and links to the deodorant. I'm sure we've already made that we joke. Probably Let's that stop. Joke. Let's stop Let's and go, start yeah. again next year. Okay, thanks for listening, everybody. We love you. Here is Talking Frog. Bye. Featuring Ramdas. Bye. Bye. <laughs> From Bithloof. I uh, see. He did come back. lovely story of a, a man walking down the street and uh, it's a man about my age an older man 
probably older than me, I think. I think about this story. And a voice says, Psst, could you help me out? And the man looks around and he doesn't see anybody. Psst, could you help me out? Looks again and he looks down and there's a frog. He says to the frog, did you speak to me? And the frog says, yeah, could you help me out? says, I'm under a curse, and if you would kiss me, I would turn into the most beautiful, desirable man. I would serve you and love you and warm your bed and take care of you, and I'd make you so happy. So the man thinks about it for a while. And then he reaches down, he picks up the frog, and he sticks it in his pocket, and he walks out. After a little while, the frog says, Hey, you forgot to kiss me. The man says, Well, you know, at my age, it's more interesting to have a talking frog. <laughs>